Hey, what's up? Mr. Love here. Uh, today we're going to take a look at a, a relatively simple uh, modern physics um, energy equation. Um, and in this, uh, in this problem, we are going to um, calculate the energy of a single photon of blue light um, at a given wavelength of 450 nanometers. So anytime we're solving these problems, the first thing you want to go ahead and do is um, define out your variables. So the wavelength is equal to 450 nanometers. That's pretty obvious from the problem. And um, we have a couple formulas in, in sort of our bag of tricks here. We know that C, the speed of light, is equal to the wavelength times the frequency. Um, and we also know um, from the modern physics section that E, the energy, is equal to Planck's constant H times the frequency. And so um, we're given this wavelength here. So what we're going to go ahead and do is combine these two equations. And when we... Um, we rearrange uh, this equation here to solve for F. Um, it looks like this. E is equal to H C over lambda. Um, and we can, uh, we can go ahead and substitute, right? Because H is a constant, C is a constant, and we have the wavelength. So H is equal to 6.63 times 10 to the negative 34th joules per second. And the speed of light is 3.0 times 10 to the 8th meters per second. And that's all over the wavelength, which is 4.5 times 10 to the minus 7th meters. Remember, things have to be in meters in order to get them to work out properly. And um, when we go ahead and, uh, and solve that for the energy, E is equal to 4.4 times 10 to the negative 19th joules. Um, dimensionally, this, uh, this works out pretty well, right? Because we have um, meters per second and joules. Uh, time seconds, so these seconds cancel out, this cancels out with that, and we're left with the unit of joules, and that's where we want to be. So each photon of this blue light um, has exactly 4.4 times 10 to the negative 19th joules. Um, thanks for watching.